Hello friends, welcome to Nandkishore classes. Today's lecture is going to be interesting because we are going to cover this type of multiplication with the shortcut method. You which you will definitely enjoy watching the video and 100% you are going to learn something new today. In our last video, we had covered the questions related to 97 multiply 98, 96 multiply 95. Those who have not seen the video, you can just check the previous video section. But yes, this video, we are going to do these type of questions using base 100 again. Base is 100, which I am going to take. Now, what's the meaning of base 100? All these questions are near to 100 values only. 100 plus something. 100 plus. How much plus? See, 107. If I add 7 to 100, I will get 107. This is plus 8. If you check here, 100 plus 4, 100 plus 3. Right, these type of questions we are having and why I am writing, you also need to write. We also need to write, this is under the process. How much we are adding to 100 to get the respective value, just write along with it as I have written in all the questions. Now, it's the fractions of seconds you will take to do the calculation. What we need to do, multiply 7 and 8, I get 56, right? Directly write 56, there is no problem. Just place an arrow, 107 plus 8, it is 115. This is the answer. See, single step it will take. You need not to do any heavy calculation. Check the next one. If it is 4 multiply 3, 4 multiply 3 is 12. And making an arrow, it means 104 plus 3. 104 plus 3 is 107. That's it. But yes, do remember, placing arrow downward is not mandatory this is not mandatory what you can do you can place arrow this way also same answer you are going to get 103 plus 4 still 107 so wherever you feel comfortable you can place the arrow here 8 nines are 72 and yes 108 plus 9 108 plus 9 if i do i'll get 117 so this is the answer Check the last one, 7 times 6 is 42, 107 plus 6 is 113. Now, one more question I am going to do, where we need to be very careful. Let me show you, let's suppose our question is 102 multiply 103. Now, 102, obviously 100 plus 2 gives me 102. 100 plus 3 gives me 103. And when you will multiply 3 and 2, you will get 6. Right? But please don't write only 6. We will write 0, 6. This is the main step. We are a little changes there. Because base is 100. Base 100 contains 2 zeros. I need 2 digits here. If at all I am getting a single digit multiplication, just add 0 along with it. Else re process remains same. 102 plus 3 is 105. This is going to be the final answer. I hope you are able to understand the concept properly. Thank you so much for watching the video.